What is up you guys and welcome back to another public freakout. Make sure to hit that thumbs up and let's jump right into it. In this first clip, we have a woman at a Walmart checkout line accusing another woman of cutting in line. The customer claims the woman that's filming came out of nowhere and cut in front of three people and stood behind her. The customer then started allowing those people behind her to cut in front of them. The woman filming then decided to block the checkout line by pushing her cart against another customer's cart. In this clip, we have a guy who walks into a postal office cutting in front of a bunch of people who've been waiting in line for more than 20 minutes. The woman he cut in front of tells him off, to which he responds by crowding her space. Even after the customers allowed him to cut in line, he still kept trying to argue with the woman, which eventually led him to getting kicked out. Get away from me! No, look at you. You're talking about the line? Get in the back. She was... I was behind you too. Shut up. Keep moving. In this clip, we have a woman and her family blocking a McDonald's drive through because the green car she's blocking cut in front of them. The guy who's filming allowed the car to cut in front of him, which provoked the woman behind him to confront the driver, demanding him to go to the back of the line. According to the filmer, the driver didn't cut, he simply came in through a different entrance. I can't get past. How am I going to drive through this guy? How am I going to drive through this This is my first Karen experience. I'm so excited. No. Drive through. Enter right here. We let her in. She's in. No. Go. 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 We were in the line too. We were in the, we were in the line too. Okay, all right, all right. Let the blood go. And we're for McDonald's, going. we're fighting over McDonald's. The world has bigger problems. All right, let's let just let them the go. Big, the world I has bigger problems, problems than who's getting in line first at McDonald's. Here we have an angry customer who claims to run a restaurant who walks behind the counter and snatches the mask of an employee for not giving her her name. Oh, what is your name? Okay, bitch, can I tell you something? I'm gonna come back there. I run a restaurant. Step back, I'm gonna call you What is your name? Step back, I'm gonna call you What is your name? What is your name? You tell me right now. In this next clip, we have a couple who decide to exit their car and stand in front of a woman's car blocking her from entering a Burger King's drive-thru. The couple claim the woman filming almost hit their car when she cut in front of them while they were making a U-turn in the parking lot. They are calling the cops, y'all, over Burger King because they made an illegal turn in the parking lot. Do you really want a Whopper that bad? This car right here, y'all decided to make a u-turn in the parking lot meanwhile we were legally going into the drive-thru and she got mad because of one car that's how press she is about this damn whopper i just came from a large onion ring okay this is what we're doing she is now calling the cops y'all and almost hit me when i was trying to get in i almost hit you 
and cut in front of me. And I don't like usually get hitting. upset, but this is. Y'all, look how close I am. This is almost hitting them. This is almost hitting them. I am not the one to play no, with. I'm not I'm, my own car. You, I'm outside my car. Exactly. Car. This is a Karen. This is a Karen. This is a Karen and a Ken. A Karen and a Ken. Yes, please. Come on, cops. Come on down here, please. In this clip, we have a guy at a Home Depot who starts yelling at random customers for choosing to shop at the same time as him and creating a long wait line. He goes to tell the customers his time is more valuable and he has clients to service versus them shopping for their garden. Here we have a customer who goes nuts on a CVS employee for what she claims to be bad service because she was a few dollars short and the employee wouldn't help her finish paying for her items. Because I lost my checks on the goddamn ground, I wouldn't pay for it. But you couldn't help me with that, could you? By all means, you suck at customer service. I was exceptional. You weren't. The f I wasn't. I had quality scores that would make you blush. So shut up. You don't know my history. You haven't seen my resume. In this next clip, we have a woman who confronts a driver who almost caused her to have an accident while her baby's in the car. He tailed her car because she put a bumper sticker that he doesn't agree with. He tells the woman he doesn't care about telling her and that it makes him happy to see her upset. You were very close to my car. I was very close. Why? Because I can. Because you can be close to my car? Because I can, yes. No, you I can. can. You do realize tailgating is illegal, right? Well, okay, call the cops. They cannot do nothing. Okay. Are you going to continue to drive like that? Okay, on the road that I live drive on? Drive how I drive. Why do you why do you drive like that? What's the goal? Because I can. It's America. What's your name? Why? Because I need to know. Why do you need Because it? I need to know. Why do you need Because it? you almost caused an accident you on my child. Do you have a warrant for my name? No, so I don't. Can drive off. No. But I will gladly call the police and let them know how you're driving. Okay, so they can't do nothing about it. Okay, I have you on video. Uh -oh. I have your license plate number. What do you have me on video doing? Driving. Driving. Yes, so and now I have. Me over and write me a citation or whatever for driving. I will call them and let them know how you're driving. And they still can't do nothing. Sure they can. What can they do? They have no proof. Drive on, please. No. You're an asshole. Yeah, I know. Thank you. And so that makes you happy? No, it makes me happy that you're upset. That's the kind of person you are? No. In this next clip, we have a customer who's not too happy about being denied service. The guy walks behind the counter and helps himself with a pack of cigarettes and throws $5 at the employee telling him that he can owe him the change. He then decided to completely destroy the store, breaking everything on the counter while the employee is on the phone with the cops. Cigarettes now dude. But right here, let's call this the barter system. $5? You can owe me. You can owe me. You call the cops. I'm an easy man to find. Hey, I'm a little interested in these two. Oh, oh, is the, someone hit me and the, I hit got... Hit with the Jojo? Yeah, he took a lot to the Jojo. I'm oh my Jesus. God. I'm he's hit me. He's throwing everything bird. and he's killed me. Help you. Help oh, 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 oh. Okay, he did destroy the store. He destroyed the store. Where is cop? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! They destroyed the store! 
In this last clip, we have a guy who's trying to steal a bike in front of a mall while people are filming him. And that wraps up this video. Thank you for staying tuned to the end. Make sure to hit that thumbs up and I will see you next time.